You're Let holding it like it's a piece of piece of paper. <laughs> it's actually it very heavy. Put it on your shoulder. Nice. Okay, from the from the champ himself. Nice. I'm not born in Myanmar, but my heart is in Myanmar, right? You've always said that yeah. since day one. Yeah, right. I always said that maybe I was born in Myanmar in my uh, previous, previous life. life you know? Yeah. So, all right, okay, one, two, three, go. I French my entire life, and uh, English is like you is my second language. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh wow. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> yeah. But it's, you know, when we get school, it's a little bit easier to learn. Uh, in Canada, everything you know, a lot of people speak English, and TV's in English as well. So, of course, yeah. so but you know, you speak very well. Yeah. Was there any process of learning English though? I, I I started learning at a very young age with TV and uh, at school. I also I not formally helped. though. Mm -hmm. not, not, no, not formally. Yeah. Oh wow! And then my parents <laughs> spoke it. So I just want to say thank you so much. Thank you so much. Um, Hey, what's up everyone? I'm very excited. I'm so excited. Guess where I'm at? I'm at the Dave, uh, Dave LeDuc's house here in Cambodia and we're going to meet him in a few moments. I'm, so, I'm just so excited to meet the man, the legend, the myth. All right, so let's go meet him. Hi, Ming Lava, Hi. Ming Lava Chem. I'm good, good, I'm good. Oh my Welcome. goodness. Yeah. Welcome to the, the, the headquarters. The headquarters yeah. of Myanmar Embassy. Yes. <laughs> Basically, it's a Myanmar Embassy yeah, here. Yeah, exactly. You can see the flag. Amazing. Here we got the Myanmar flag yep. and Cambodia. What? Yeah, we, have a, we have a big party also coming soon. Uh, oh. so we're going to invite all the, the whole uh, the community in Myanmar here. Oh, and, really? Uh, the, the, uh, yeah, it's gonna be really beautiful. We have the tea leaf salad. We have a bunch of food. For, how soon? How soon is it? Um, it's gonna be on October six. October six. So if you can make oh, it that's back, that's so close. Like, yeah. That's so close. <laughs> yeah. I know, Jamie Sue. Yeah. So um, the, that's that's the headquarters. So we have. Maybe, the, maybe if you would like to explain this a little bit, yeah. So the, you know, when I first came to Myanmar uh -huh. in 2016, uh, yeah. the the. The Myanmar people cannot tell my name, my, say my name Dave, right? Uh -huh, so uh -huh. they started calling me Dewa. Dewa. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> and Dewa is, uh, is right, uh, kind of a, an ogre, kind of a story, right? Like yeah, if you don't yeah. eat your food, the Dewa is going to come, right? If you Correct. don't say, Correct. so yeah, brush yeah. your teeth or Dewa is going to come, right? Yeah. So um, kind of the protector or the... Uh, sort of, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah kind yeah, of angel. Like. Of, there's many meaning to Dewa, right? A lot, a lot. Yeah. But, uh, so I really like this name, but then... Dude. When I came to Cambodia for my last fight, uh, you know, it was a big it's success. From yeah, I did. Yeah, I, I watched all the, yeah. About 20 million people watched the fight. We had... Uh, I think it's more. more probably on, more, yeah. Yeah, on the internet. That's and more. we had like 40,000 people. Uh, I think it was uh, viewed by 15 million live. Yeah, exactly. 15 million, and yeah. then on YouTube more. So it was really of beautiful. Course, yeah, we had the, we got re we were received by um, His Excellency uh, Hun Manet, right? Before <laughs> the fight. So it was a, really um, a big moment for Myanmar and Cambodia because... Um, Myanmar and Myanmar has always been friends with Cambodia. We never had a really... Oh, that's annoying. <laughs> <laughs> we, we never had fights, right, in our history. It's always been friends. I don't remember. Yeah, yeah exactly. It's remember. very... Or if it was, it was very... Uh, it was very brief. We always been friends for thousands of years. So this fight has a big significance for, uh, for us. It did, it did. Yeah. I mean, just look here. I'm in Cambodia now mm -hmm. and you're here. Yeah. As a Myanmar and Canadian, yeah, right? Yeah, exactly, <laughs> you know, exactly. I searched you on Google and it says Burmese Canadian. Yep. I'm like, oh wow, very honored, very honored, <laughs> that's, yeah. that's cool. I'm not born in Myanmar, but my heart is in Myanmar, right? You've I, always said that yeah. since day one. Yeah, right. I always said that maybe I was born in Myanmar in my uh, previous, previous life. life you know? yeah. yeah. So, but yeah. So just to continue on this, when I came here, they couldn't say my name, Dave. Oh, same, same story. Same as Myanmar. So they started say Dao, Dao, oh. because the V is like Ao. So Dao, Dao. And it means sword. Oh. So, yeah. Wow, so, bro, that's so smart yeah. of you that you, you basically embrace the, this culture as well. In some I, sense, I, I mean. Give, I, I, I give them a, a wink. Also, I, I tell them I appreciate because right now in Myanmar, the situation is really bad. Oh, and yeah. and uh, they accept Myanmar people very, very well here, very easily, you know, mm -hmm. visa wise. And uh, yeah, yeah. so um, I, I wanted to say again, it's a thank you. I thank you for oh, that, wow. uh, and I chose to, to to be here also with my family. My my, my son was born here couple, uh, two months ago. Oh, was it? Was, yeah, it, was, yeah, he, was he born, born here? here yeah. I thought he was born in Russia. No, my my no, he was born in uh, Turkey. My first one, and oh. my second one is born here. Oh, yeah. the second one, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So for me, it was um, 
it was uh, I wanted to play I wanted a place that's safe, it's stable, uh -huh. and for, and uh, it was very uh, so Cambodia has been very welcoming uh, while the situation in Myanmar gets gets uh, get better. Yeah. And um, but the funny thing is, right in in, uh, in Burmese language, Dao Dao is also uh, a symbol of uh, of honor, right? A title uh -huh. of honor. So I guess I guess it fits well together. Dao Dewa. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, they kind of it, it's like a cognate similarity in some sense. Yeah, I think in, in language, language yeah. terms, yeah. 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 So that, maybe, that maybe it actually did they actually share some similarity in, in meaning and so. in pronunciation? Who knows? I think so, I think so, yeah, yeah. so it's a nice mix between you know the Khmer culture and the Myanmar culture. Uh, so I'm very uh, very uh, happy and uh, amazing, yeah. amazing. So amazing. If, you, if you're if you're uh, you're Burmese and you want to come, you come to the party on October sixth. Hopefully you can make it too. That would be nice. Let's ah, see. Let's see. That's so yeah. close. You're not far. You're, not, you're in Thailand, right? I am. Thailand, so it's yeah, only yeah. an hour flight. We'll talk. We'll Correct. talk. Yeah, we'll talk. We'll yeah, talk. Yeah. Oh, Canada. Oh, Canada. Yeah, right. Quebec. You know Quebec? So, I, I, uh, I heard it. I heard Montreal. you said it in uh, the, the podcast with Joe Rogan, but yes. I, I, I don't know where it so is. So Canada is very big, and then you have a, one province on the and speak the speak French. Oh. Yeah. So no wonder it's one of the official languages in because of, Canada. Because of Quebec, exactly. Oh, so because wow. of uh, one province, the entire country has the official language of French, oh. but most people speak English. Yeah. I see. Yeah. I see. But, uh, yeah, I spoke French my entire life, and uh, English is like you is my second language. Oh. Yeah. 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 Oh wow! Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. But it's, you know, we get school. Uh, it's a little bit easier to learn uh, in Canada. Everything you know, a lot of people speak English, and TV's in English as well. So, of course, yeah. so but you know, you speak very well. Was there any process of learning English though? I I, I started learning at a very young age with TV and uh, at school. I also I not formally though. Mm -hmm. yeah, not no, not, uh, not formally. Yeah. Oh wow! And then my parents <laughs> spoke it. So yeah, we're very. You know, the thing is, we're very close from Ottawa, the capital Ottawa, of Canada. Yeah, yeah. So my province, my my city, is like maybe ten minutes from Ottawa. So mm. pretty much everybody speaks English. Oh, know? I see. Yeah. Sort of like the way we speak Burmese. Pretty much, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Awesome. So, that's so yeah, so that's the we're opening in about two weeks. So we have a it's like scoop right now. Like we have nobody seen this so far. You're the first one to come. We're gonna put the tables everywhere. I did this myself. It's oh, all, it's like an experience, right? You go to the toilet. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Let me feel it. So it's like yeah, a lot of work. This was. I probably lost at least two years of life with all the smoke, all the paint that I inhaled. <laughs> but it's okay. It's, work, it's working. I'll show you this. So this is the front door. Mm -hmm. That's the, so the first floor we have a coffee shop. Right? So it's going to be uh, drinks and uh, coffee. And it's going to be the counter? Yeah, so the counter you go here, the menu is going to be here. Ah. Yeah. So you order here and we're going to have a sweet uh, kind, of, uh, it's kind of fried balls. With, with, uh, it's, it's very unique, it's like a dessert and uh, we have drinks here. And then look, look at the wall. Oh, wow. <laughs> well, that was painted, and then you can see, right? Yeah, that's Myanmar. And then Dewa. Dewa. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah. So, uh, and this is so rich in meaning. It's nice. That yeah. the wall is so rich in meaning. So, wow. the, da, the, the sword. The, the, how do you say sword in, in Burmese? Myanmar. Da. So, say, exactly. Yeah, da, exactly. Yeah. So, it's Da. That's what I was saying, yeah. yeah. Dao yeah. and. So, da. it's the Da house, you know? The, the da sword da house. house. Sword yeah, house, basically. Yeah. Wow. So, um, you see, I, and then I have the da, the Dab Army. So they, oh. basically, the first floor is the coffee shop, and the second floor is my Dab Army, which is the eSport team, Mobile Legend. I, I saw yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, I saw the video. Yeah. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna have uh, this. I'm gonna cater to, um, I guess we'll see, we'll see. But the the, the, the audience, the, the clientele here, I believe, are gonna be a bit a bit younger because um, we have a, a, a sport Mobile Legend team here. Let, let me show you. So let's see. <laughs> You can take it, you can get, you can oh, wow! And it's, yeah, it's gonna be sick. So I made the floor too myself. <laughs> so we, I put some paint and then I put some sealer on top of it. It's really uh, very unique. I think nobody has that floor in the oh, world. Wow! Because this oh. is. Uh, it doesn't look like a floor. It looks like uh, some sort of, uh, you know, a decorated bed or something. <laughs> you know what it is? I learned that when I was a kid. My dad was making uh, ma you know, mazes. You know, like, like, uh, yeah. so you start, let's say, you start from here, and then you have, it's a maze. So it's it's like you have to find your way all the way to the end. So it's it's a maze, and uh, I, I used to do these things on on, uh, on small piece of paper, and now I did it. <laughs> Can we stand in front of the the, the knives real quick? Yeah, of course. I think that's gonna be sick. Like no. <laughs> Some stands. How do you do that? 
Because if your leg weight A is a little bit not too oh. good, that means you're 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 kind amateur. of amateur, you know. Oh. So you can see the the uh, my my leg weight A has improved over the years. When in my first fight, I did not know anything. You know, my first fight with uh, Tutu, uh, rest in peace. He he, he uh, it might it was not good. And then after that, I fought Tutu Men. Also, was getting a little bit better. It was a draw. Your very first fight yeah. was a draw against but the I, champion. But I, but, I, but I dominated the first. Fight. Of course, of course. <laughs> but uh, yeah, that's another story. I, I, I was ready for this fight, yeah. <laughs> so then, yeah, the let, uh, and you start your let with you with your let come on, and then you do it, and uh -huh. then you finish, you close it with your let, let come on again, and then you salute, you salute uh -huh. So uh, for those who don't know, that the, the, the let come on is, uh, is, is very old. It's a 1,000 year old gesture. Of, it is, uh, it is. And it, people, you know, Myanmar people were doing this in the, in the warfare before, you know, fighting in Thailand, fighting right. in, in other countries. Let, let's, and, and it kind of, um, uh, gives you a, a, a trigger, you know, it triggers a trigger, you, yeah, yeah. you know, uh, Tony Robbins, uh, he's a um, famous uh, speaker, I know, I know him, yeah. and he says before going on stage, he hits his chest, right? Oh, so that's a trigger, so oh, I have to go speak, right? So in Myanmar, you know, we do let it, let's wait, <laughs> now we fight, let's <laughs> it's a trigger, mental a trigger. trigger. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah exactly. to, to basically to get pumped, right? Exactly. To get the I have goosebumps, now I'm ready to fight now, let's fight. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go upstairs. Okay. The transition, the gun type. Last thing is from uh, oh, 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 wait, wait. <laughs> I'm gonna take my bag off for that. <laughs> Shall I do a little intro for this, this part? Yeah, for sure. Alright guys, so we're gonna enter the most significant room, I should say, <laughs> in uh, Dave's house. It's, it's, it's uh, the room of his belt collection. Um, so, I think you have six. Uh, yeah, six, because it's six times. One of them has two uh, meetings, so uh, oh, I have five. Oh, I see. Because, it's uh, six time champ. Yeah. <laughs> oh, wow. The first one uh, is very special to me. It's, the, it's actually like the, the smallest in size. It's the Air KBZ um, 2016. So uh, you see, we have the. Um, the the two lit the two lit way fighter with the the Tokwin right the oh, fighting oh Tokwin so, yeah yeah so when I first fought and uh, when I first won the belt I noticed that if you want to see the so I, I uh, started studying the the history of the Tokwin and I realized that a lot of lit way fighters nowadays don't have it and oh, yeah, it's yeah. it's, a, it's a kind of a dying it's kind of a dying tradition mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and uh, for me I thought it was very it was a shame to lose that beautiful tradition because it's very unique. Everything about Myanmar, you know, when it comes to uh, the, the fighting aspect is so unique. Uh, it's the last, let Myanmar Yoya Litwe, traditional Litwe, is the last remaining art in the world that you can do headbutts, mm -hmm. you know? Everything else is, uh, um, has been uh, watered down, you know? Modified. Modified and, yeah. and, and kind of make, uh, let's, let's, uh, let's make it uh, less, a bit brutal. Easy, less brutal to appeal to, let's say, the, 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 the mothers and the, the kids. Bigger market. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> well... You know, we'll never kind of please everybody, but I, I, I really gonna fight until until I would die to keep the headbutts oh, in Lithuania. Wow. You know, this is wow. this is the beauty, that's the uniqueness of, of the sport. Yeah. <laughs> okay, let so. me put it on. <laughs> yeah, 
So yeah, everybody in Myanmar knows Air KBZ is uh, one of the biggest airline in the country, and they sponsor it is, Myanmar it is, way. It is. And uh, so this is 2016, and then um, afterwards there was more. You know, we have uh, this is in America. And, uh, With the in the, the, the Washington yeah, one. Yeah, sorry, Washington. So oh, in Wyoming, right? In Wyoming, yeah. So, wow. Uh, the US US. Uh, on U.S. soil, the first time we had the uh, Myanmar Yoga other way like, in USA. Is this is the Eagle Head. No, this is a, a, actually a Spartan. It's like a a, 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 oh, a knight. Oh, Spartan. Yeah, 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 yeah. See, this is the the hair. Oh. And, uh, yeah. Oh, wow. So, yes, and because of that, you know, they created because of us, Sparta Litway, so it's a Spartan, a Spartan, Spartan. Yeah. and uh, they created Litway, so we really, you know, promoting the, the sport outside of the, another continent, it's, it was never been held in, in North America ever, you know, no, 2,000 years time. old, you know, yeah. and it was on pay-per-view for the first time also like this, so very uh, happy to see the growth. Give me one second. Yeah. <clears throat> <laughs> and then we have also the one in, in, in Japan. I L F J. Yeah, International Lightweight Federation Japan. Japan. Yeah. Oh. And also the the fighters here. When was that? Twenty seventeen. Two thousand seventeen. Yeah. Seventeen. I see. And then the WLC. This one is really heavy compared to the other ones. Oh, <laughs> oh my goodness! How many pounds is it? Uh, this is I think nine kilos. Nine kilos. That's like eighteen, yeah. nineteen pounds. Very heavy. So this one I traveled, uh, you know, for seminars, and I, I broke it this in the plane. <laughs> so much traveling with this one, uh, you know, in in, in, the, in Europe. The VLC. Yeah. yeah. I, I I saw your seminars. Yeah. yeah. Or Warsaw, yeah. Poland, Poland uh, Spain, Portugal, Slovenia, um, Slovenia, or Slovakia, 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 yeah. Iceland, um, Czech Republic, Poland. Yeah. You're I'm holding it like it's a piece of piece of paper. <laughs> it's actually very on, heavy. Put it on your shoulder. <laughs> nice. Okay. From the from the champ himself. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> thank oh, you, sir. It. Thank you. Perfect. Oh, wow. Wow. Yeah, and that's yeah, the last one. one also in Myanmar in 2018. Uh, see Myanmar, Thailand. Which Korea. one was with Tun Tun Min? Uh, so this this one, mm -hmm. and um, yeah, this one was a Tun Tun Min in 2016. Oh. Yeah. Was there a belt on the line with Tutu? With Tutu, no, there was no belt on the line. Yeah, exactly, exactly. I mean, yeah. it, that makes sense because it was your first appearance, exactly, right? Exactly, exactly. But then I. But, but, I, but you did what you did. Exactly. <laughs> I have to show the the VMR. Okay, Here we are. Hotel, 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 yeah. hands up. Yeah, it's a little bit different, huh? <laughs> 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 All right. So there's a trick. There's a trick, right? So the goal is to do you want to wrap the top, you want to wrap your own thumb that it gives you more strength. Yeah. Like so no, you own top. You want to wrap. Oh, yeah. Okay. So that gives you more strength. Then you go. You want to. You want to circle. You want to uh, top roll. Is it? Like no. Like see. Like this. You're strong. But if I do this, you like I try to break the wrist. Now I'm like I'm going. It sits a little oh. bit. So, so there's like little yeah, tricks. I like feel it. I felt yeah. it. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay, One, two, three, go. He's strong. He's strong. I'm give just, me. Give me. <laughs> You ready? 50. One, two, three, go. Ah. <laughs> I, should, I should have said 30. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I have to say 30%. Nice, man. Ah. Well, uh, I have to say thank you for the massive hospitality. It's been pleasure. amazing, amazing. Thank you so much. <laughs> happy yeah, to see you here. I'm happy to you come visit. Oh, of course, of course. I mean, you know, I said in the intro, actually. If you, you're in Cambodia, and if you're in Myanmar and don't visit, in Cambodia, it's like going to the party and not dancing or drinking. Yes, yes, yeah, happy. Yeah, it's yeah. yeah, something I want to ask is, of course, our guys are fighting. Yeah. Do is fighting tonight, right? Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna live stream it tonight. We're gonna watch. We're gonna I, I, I saw it. Yeah, yeah I saw yeah. it. And then we have uh, Souls fighting uh, soon. So then, Ooh and uh, Tanzin uh, on Love fight recently. And, uh -huh. and so yeah, it's a lot of action happening right now. Unfortunately, it's it's not into Litway, you know. That's the <laughs> that's the thing that makes me a little bit sad is that, um, like you see, we were looking at the belts. We were looking at like we made a lot of progress, you know, Japan, America, oh, yeah. and then uh, what makes me a little bit sad right now is that all the the, the Myanmar guys have to go compete in Muay Thai. You know, yeah. so uh, I'm happy uh, that you know one championship is able to give them an opportunity to compete. Um, but you know, if you look at all the the progress we've made, you know, bring Litway in in, um, in Japan, bring Litway in America. The growth was really really rapid in it only was. a few years. People around the world were so excited to go to, to come to Myanmar to train Litway. 
You yeah, know? yeah, I noticed that too. Yeah. Yeah. So I really realized that Litway was going to put Myanmar on the map, you know, because when I started in uh, 2016, a lot of my people, my friends and, and people I knew in Canada, I said, I'm, I'm fighting in Myanmar. They didn't even know where it was. They didn't know it was a country. They said, which country is it? Is it uh, insulting? <laughs> you know, you, you're, you're from there, right? Uh -huh. And it's like, I exist, right? I exist. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. So for me, it was, it was a big shock when I, real I came to Myanmar, the golden land with the Shredagon Pagoda and the, all the, you know, the, the, uh, a beautiful culture and, and Myanmar Litway, so rich. In, 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 uh, in, and I, I thought to myself, 55 million people that are kind of forgotten, you know, and oh, it pissed me yeah. off. And I said, I, I, and then I, I got, I won and I got accepted very warmly like the word, you know, Minglawa means, uh -huh. I warmly welcome. So I got accepted warmly by Myanmar. And I said to myself, I will, give, I will do my best to put the spotlight on, on Myanmar, you know. So that's why I dedicated my life to, to Myanmar Lewe. And I knew that if we, ride, if we, 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 uh, we elevate Lewe uh, high enough, people, they're going to want to visit, similar to what happened in Thailand. Thailand yeah. Exactly. So uh, the economy is better, but now... We got hit with uh, COVID and the situation oh, uh, that's happening yeah. right now. It's just so sad. It's so sad. Uh, going back to the fighters, um, I, I knew I knew you, uh, you you were gonna have some sort of this a little, a little bit of dissatisfaction. Let's say mm -hmm. that the the the, the yeah. Myanmar fighters are now competing in one. But they don't it, have it's good choice. for financially. It's yeah. good for them. Yeah. But yeah. What else? What else can you do right now? Right? There's not. There's not a lot of fights happening. There's no international fight happening. It's very hard. Wow, it's very hard. Yeah, <clears throat> it's, it's a shame, and we don't know how long it's going to last. You know, that's the that's the that's the the, the sad part. So I'm 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 urging. Oh, yeah. You know. yeah, 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 it is. How do you see the fights going though? Um, we we do we do we, mm -hmm. do we, you, you know them? I mean, yeah. So Tui is is, uh, is the current Myanmar champion in yes. open weight. Uh, he's a lighter weight. Uh, mm -hmm. You know, he, he actually did very well against Tung Tung Min. Um, so yeah, he's very yeah. skilled. Actually, very... I watched the second fight. Okay. Yeah, okay, yeah. I went live. I, yeah. I mean, I watched it live. Yeah, I think he's a great fighter. Um, and uh, I think he can do pretty well because he's, he's more technical. He's not the, like... I think his power is to is to hit at timing that you don't expect because he's not the power puncher. Like, Tutu Min is a power puncher. He you know? is. So that's, it's going to be an interesting fight to see. Yeah, I think uh, I respect him. I think he's good. Um but yeah, so so it reminds me a little bit of you know back in the days uh, for those who know uh, Sagaman Shaw Shark. Yeah. So yeah. he was the open weight champion at eighty kilograms, and he got challenged by Tuema Shong. Yeah. Right. Tuema yes. Shong was sixty five kilograms, not sixty seven. <laughs> so big, big, because he's a warrior, right? I mean, yeah. And yeah. he challenged, and he did a draw against Shaw Shark. So that's the beauty of Myanmar you know, Lightweight. Like in open weight, you can challenge for the crown because the, the you have people often confused that there's no weight class in lightweight, but there is. There's weight class, you know, all oh, yeah, yeah, the yeah. way to yeah. eighty, right? All uh, the way to uh, open weight. KG. Exactly. And uh, you can challenge for the open weight crown because the, oh, wow. the open weight champion is the best in lightweight. So you Basically can be the undisputed exactly. champion. Yeah. yeah. But now the undisputed title is thrown around like well, yeah, exactly. in UFC and one as well. You you won the title and you're undisputed champion. What what does it mean? Mm. It's just an extra word, I think. It doesn't have any true say, maybe not significance, but yeah. any meaningful addition, right? Yeah. You ju you're just the champion. Mm -hmm. Undisputed in boxing, it, it makes sense to me. You have, there are four belts. I'm a boxing fan, so yeah, yeah, <laughs> I know yeah. a lot about boxing that I'm more about. I should say. Okay. Uh, Four belts, if you want uh, two, it's a unified, three yeah. unified, four undisputed, that makes sense. But makes in sense, one yeah. and UFC, they call every champion undisputed, so. Yeah, in their own promotion, it's a bit confusing, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, good point, good point. So yeah, to, to come back to uh, to Lilway, it's going to be an interesting, uh, I'm, in one part, I'm sad that we cannot compete in Lilway. Mm -hmm. On the other hand, I'm happy to see the success of the guys. Uh, to show that the you know they're in in a different martial art they're able to succeed because a lot of people that that are multi fighters that go into Myanmar Litway they did not do very well you know a lot of foreigners come in and they get knocked out they get hurt they get cut because of bare knuckle uh, and so and the headbutt yeah, exactly exactly a lot of Thai champions come into Myanmar and they get they get hurt because of that so for me it was it's nice to see Solin O for example uh, doing very well under Muay Thai rules you know. With his little skills, even Veronica, Veronica, Ver 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 also she's a she's a trained in Myanmar. Now they're what? 
Yeah. Was she a lightweight fighter? I'm yeah, that's what I'm saying. She's a Burmese lightweight fighter. She competed. We, uh, when I fought with Tutu, she fought that same night as me. Oh, on the same card? Yeah, yeah, yeah same card. Oh, yeah, so, uh, I see. No, not Tutu. It was against Cyrus Washington. Yeah, she fought. Uh, she fought uh, so, so now she's a Tiger Muay Thai in Phuket, but she's a, mm. you know, she's a lightweight fighter. She, oh, wow. Uh, yeah. I so, thought she only did boxing. No, she did lightweight. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah. She fought in Tokyo also in the same card as me. She fought in Japan and then Oh, I thought I knew a lot about her. Yeah, yeah. So, so, you know, we, that's why that's why uh, she she has a strong and strong hands also. So she's tough. Uh, yeah. she, but now she's like number one or number. She's in the top of Muay Thai. She, she's basically the queen of Muay Thai here. Exactly. Yeah. Imagine, you know. So Amazing. we should be proud. And a lot of Myanmar people don't know that, you know. And so. Yeah, how yeah. how different are Muay Thai and the way though? Except for the headbutt. Yeah. Well, I think it's 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 extremely different. Actually, we cannot even we can, we have to talk about the headbutts because when you're doing the clinch, right? Mm -hmm. If in Muay Thai, I cannot do the headbutt, so I'm not afraid of doing this. Okay. But now this, I'm I'm safe in in Muay Thai, but in Lithuania, I'm not. Oh, of course. So if you want to be safe in Muay Thai and in, uh, in Lithuania, I can I have to put my hand here, right? So if you headbutt me. I, I'm, my head, my hand's gonna block me. So I have to lose a limb, lose a hand, to protect uh -huh. myself, which completely reduce, you cannot, if I, if I put my hand on your head, I cannot do uppercuts, I cannot use, I cannot do anything, I have to protect. So oh. let, the clinch is, is completely different. It's minus one. Yeah, minus one. Oh, yeah. Wow, I so see. So it changes the game completely. And that's why a lot of uh, Thai fighters, Thai champions, they go into the clinch in, in, uh, in Latway, they don't, they think, ah, it's, the headbutts is not a big difference. But then they get, you know, we, see, we saw a video, a very famous video, you can maybe put it, is um, uh, 2T. Uh, uh, I'll show you, I'll show you, it's very, it's really, really nice. But. So, so this is very important. Also, the fact that when you have a big difference as well is to, uh, Muay Thai fighters, they, they're going to punch, jab a lot in the face and they, they get comfortable getting touched. Mm -hmm. you know? In boxing, same thing. You get comfortable just right. touching, touching. Yeah. But if you do that in Lithuania, you're going to get cut. With the bare knuckles. Exactly. Yeah. Oh. So you become lazier in, with gloves and you become more... Um, yeah, you become more uh, nonchalant. With, nonchalant. With, yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's very dangerous. I just want to say thank you so much. Thank you so much. Um, Chizu wa na? Nye wa de wa miya ya? Chizu miya ya te wa. Nikao ne, nikao ne, nikao ne. Chizu miya ya te wa re ku de wa. So de wa, so de wa. So de wa, yeah. Thank you so much. Thank you. It's been, it's been, uh, uh, I can say, the best moment of my life so far. Oh, man. <laughs> I see. Anytime you hear, anytime you hear, you, you consider this your home. And, uh, you, you know, we're going to... That's so sweet. That's so sweet. Your message to the audience? Thank you so much for the support. Alan uh, Kuchite, please uh, stay strong. And uh, we are, um, I know we are with you in, in spirit. And I'm sending all my strength. I love you. Thank you.